baby. Say hi, YouTube. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, ladies. So it's me, Jenny. Um, I'm just coming on here to do an update with Miss Lily. She got crazy hair because she just got out of the bath, if you can see. Um, and I'm sorry I haven't really updated, but there's not a whole lot to update on when you're doing the FUT. I mean, basically, hold up here, I like my angle better. <laughs> uh, basically, I was on birth control since the start of the year, the new year. I stopped my birth control Saturday was my last pill. Sorry, I'm rocking. It's a habit. Um, right, let's see, Lily. Let's come over here. Sorry. Okay. You have crazy hair. So, yeah. Saturday was my last um, birth control. Sunday, I started my estrogen twice a day. And I think I'm on that... I have to look at my timeline. I don't know. I'm on it twice a day for a while, and then it goes up to three times a day. I think starting next week. Um, and that's really it. And then I get I go for a lining check on the 29th of January. And at the lining check, I um, I think it's the next day they call. I can't remember, and it's so sad because they just did one in December. Um, but they call. They'll call and let me know what my levels are. Hi, baby. And, uh, she probably thinks I'm a weirdo because I'm talking to myself. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so. That's it. I mean, there's not a whole lot going on. Little Miss Lilybug had an, uh, ear infection. So that was, has not been fun. And she, this was her second one, and we did a round of moxicillin, and it didn't work. Like, it didn't clear it up. Well, I think it kind of helped her, but it didn't actually clear it up because then, like, two or three days later, before we went for the checkup, um, she had a fever. So we took her on, on a Saturday, and then, yeah, they said that she still had the ear infection, so I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't think it went away and came back. I think the amoxicillin just didn't work the second time, um, where the first time it worked perfect. So they had us, they put us on um, Omnicef, and we had 10 days of that, and we went back for a checkup. On uh, last Thursday, <laughs> and um, sorry, and they said that her ears still weren't clear. They were like ten thousand times better than they were, but they still were not like a hundred percent clear. So that's kind of annoying. So they wanted her to stay on the Omnicef for like another eight days. Um, I'm not a big fan of keep giving her the antibiotics, but at the same time, um, if it's gonna like completely clear, maybe it will kind of give her. I'm hoping it will kind of boost her, uh, like, her little immune system, at least for the, the next month or two, like, through the winter months, because for whatever reason, it's, like, been really cold, like, freaky cold, like, 27 degrees cold, like, what the hell? This is Arizona, not, I'm not supposed to be this cold, so, um, but yeah, that's all that's really been going on, I've been working, um, we had to change our schedule, well, I had to change, well, everybody had to change their schedule, I guess, except for my husband, um, but I am no longer working four days a week. I'm working five days a week, which kind of sucks. But it's been nice because I get off at four every day. Sorry, I'm rocking again. Um, so that's nice. And since she's going, she's so she's off. For, she kind of has a weird schedule because, not weird, but she goes to daycare four days a week. And then she's home with her dad Friday. So, um, where she was home with me Monday and with her dad Friday. So, I switched her centers because I really wasn't happy with the other center. And then since she was going to be going more often... Um, another day I wanted her, um, somewhere else that I felt more comfortable where she liked because she cried almost every day. So, um, we gave notice that, that center and I found another center that's freaking awesome. The only downside is, um, we need, uh, we only needed a part-time rate and that's only six hours, but we really need like seven hours, but I didn't want to pay a full day rate for only one extra hour. Yeah, that's mommy's eye. Where's Lily's nose? I. I. Yeah. Where's your nose? Where's your nose? Uh. Nose. That's right. Uh. Nose. Don't poke your nose. Uh. Nose. Oh, you dropped your milk. So yeah. Um. 
But yeah, so we switched our center. So it's kind of nice now the routine because basically I take a late lunch at one, um, and I um, go pick her up from daycare. She's like amused with herself that she can see herself. I uh, pick her up from daycare, and um, so I get to talk to her teacher and see her in the middle of the day, and I bring her home, and then. Basically, by the time we get home, I'm home with her maybe 15, 20 minutes, and then her dad gets home from work. Um, and so I go back to work for a few more hours um, until 4. So it, it's nice. It's been working out. This is the second week so far, and, uh, you know. <laughs> You're a silly girl. Yeah, so it's been working out. Um, so that's kind of what's been going on in the start of the new year. Baby. Baby. You're too close. Baby. 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 <laughs> Baby. Baby. You're too close, Mama. Baby. Baby. That's Liliana. <laughs> Stop it. Don't be silly. Ah. Don't be silly. But yeah, that's what's been going on with us. Nothing too exciting. My, uh... <laughs> Stop. Don't touch. My transfer, uh, like I said, my lining check is January 29th. Transfer is scheduled... Are you out of here? Transfer is scheduled for uh, February 4th. I have to start my cycle by the 18th or else everything gets pushed back to February 18th, which is kind of crummy, but... It is what it is. So, yeah. I um, will give you guys another update. Um, probably. Uh, maybe I'll do another update once I start my cycle. But, yeah. I'm sorry I haven't been on very often. It's just there's not a whole lot to update on. Um, yeah. There's not a whole lot to update on. So, if you guys have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Otherwise, I will give you guys an update in a few weeks. This is such a better view. I hate this view. I hate my my double chin. I think even if I lost weight, I would still have a double chin. What do you guys think? Some people are just destined to have two chins. <laughs> I'll talk to you ladies later. Bye.